Hello everyone, so this is what fifth part of the fourth uh, series, fourth try of uh, Wally uh, Stalin series. I'm going to capture Germany, that's the planet list. So, last uh, part ended with us capturing East Prussia, and now we are going to capture. Um, the Germany proper it's uh, not going that great I only have single army we can which can uh, advance successfully so I have our best general here Zhukov he was able to select tactics and I guess this tactic mass charge is what giving him most of the advantage also, the divisions they are special. Special. They, they are, I have reorganized them a bit offline. They are what? Uh, they are thick. They have 37 combat width, and they have quite a lot of artillery, as you can see. So they are good at attacking. Yeah. Um, they have small heart attack, but it's all right because. Uh, the, the war is at that phase when there are not a lot of what, there are not a lot of tanks. Yeah. So that's it. That's that was the introduction, and let's continue with uh, with the uh, game. So as you can see, I've, adv I've advanced a bit from Danzig to the east, flying to the west, I mean, and reorganized the armies a little bit. It was quite tedious and boring procedure, so I've decided to do it offline. Oh, United States. So these guys, where is our... Forgot that. Oh, so it's this guy, yeah. So let's add some some mountain troops to him. All right, have a victory. We've bombed some destroyers. So we are near Berlin, actually. And if it will go as it goes currently. German industrial capacity will be diminished significantly because Berlin is Berlin. Yeah. So right now we don't need a lot of a lot of uh, well, <sighs> garrison, but it might change in the future. So I need to keep an eye on that. Uh, as for logistics, everything is peachy, more or less. Uh, I guess I will first open all the land doctrines tree and all the land doctrine tree, and then I will proceed with um, designing some mobile uh, division stuff like that. Actually, it's entirely possible to complete uh, this war to finish off Germany without using any mobile troops at all. The mobile troops will then will be used for another countries maybe. So I can ch I cannot tank designer. Can I? I think I think it's a good idea actually. Not soft attack. We need maybe hard attack. Yeah, hard attack or research speed. Yeah, research speed is probably the best because we don't need research any tanks at all. So all right, I can see some reds here. Is it because our supply finally dropped to the point of where we just can't can't supply? Oh, it's sixty seven one percent. It's more or less fine. So can you? Yeah, they can. They can. They still can advance. It's fine. They're fine. So I think. 
I think we're advancing fine. So we're only advancing using this army, and every, anything, everything else is just sitting, staying put. Yeah. Basically, I've learned by trial and error that only Zhukov can advance because he has enough firepower, it's enough skill and firepower to like kill people. Um, we probably need to drop here some some bombers. Yeah, let's do that. Close their support. Yeah. How about this? Yeah. Something like that. That's enough, I think. That would be enough, I think. I. I. It's a pity that I didn't do it earlier, actually. Alright, skilled stuffer. Hold on to skilled stuffer quite a lot. Okay, a lot of reds. This one is promising, though. Maybe not. Yeah, this one is promising, so we are still advancing, yeah. It's still all good. And as for logistics, we are doing good. <coughs> what I'm thinking is maybe let's bump up some bump up the artillery protection. <laughs> yeah, we need to do that. We don't need fighters right now because we are managing. We manage. Air superiority, more or less fine. So let's bump up the artillery production a bit. Because we need a lot of artillery. Alright, I see that we have issues now, yeah? Or not? Do we? Yeah, I think we do. I think we do. Zhukov, what's up? Uh, yeah, supply dropped, and we probably need to stop Zhukov. Yeah, let's stop him for, for a bit and figure out the supply situation. So, what I think I'm thinking I can do is I can. Maybe maybe reduce the front line a bit. Yeah, like this. Yeah. And here. Yeah, a bit like that. So in this case we have the mm, the so supply will probably diminish here. Supply need need for the supply. Twenty nine percent, thirty eight percent. Yeah, it's better now. Thirty six. Yeah. Yeah, we're doing good. Another thing to watch out for uh, our our preparation plans. So yeah, let's unleash Rukov again. It seems that uh, the Zhukov advance ran out of steam. Maybe because of the low supply situation, maybe because of something else. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. I'm thinking maybe I need to bump up um, infrastructure in Moscow if it's not yet maximum. Yeah, like this. And um, maybe let's return the division suite here, yeah. Uh, and like do it like this. have the second line of defense here just in case yeah. something like this Seems that the front stabilized. Ah, we have we also have some issues with air spear here. Let's fix that. Fighters go there. And maybe some of these go there as well. Is it better now? Not really. Get some more here. No, it's not enough. Not enough. Oh, now it's enough. The good thing is that England is helping us with aviation and we can more or less hold our ground. So, how do you feel about oh, supplies? Supplies uh, killing us. So, how can we alleviate the situation? Will it help us here? No. Still, people are dying from attrition, I think. Let's check actually. One power lost. I don't know. No, I check that issue. Actually, it's not that bad. Um, yeah, it's fine. So, I can check our casualties. Yeah, German rig definitely has more casualties than us. It's nice. Uh, let's check what's going on with uh, So factory wise they are leading a bit. And uh, but the manpower is is drawing. Is 
is draining I mean and uh, we have uh, 4 million in the field and they have only what 3 million so <laughs> one thing to try to do would be to just call an allowed offensive but it's probably not a good idea I don't know what this does but not sure actually what this does but anyway so um, for this guy we probably need uh, entrenchment yeah. and the uh, guardian I don't know, I guess I'm just replacing them, I'm not sure. I don't, I don't understand what, what's... Actually, oh no, we don't have enough experience, sorry. So, artillery is a limiting factor. No, uh, um, endeavors. So what we can do is we can maybe move Zhukov to to another actually these guys maybe let's reduce the yeah. like this and increase area defense yeah, something like this. so so what I'm thinking is maybe remove maybe move rook of here and try to try to organize offense offensive so offensive here because oh, so it's a place here uh, suffering as well well can we so maybe we can upgrade uh, another base here yeah let's try to do that now base yeah can we try to upgrade railways yeah let's try to upgrade the railways and also let's try to upgrade naval base just once just check what will happen yeah it will come it will become greater in less than a month and uh, meanwhile I'm not sure where to put our Docks of war because everything is undersupplied. Yeah. Another thing which can be done is we can upgrade some of these to the like this, yeah, and then. We can try to advance. Also, we have some issues with fuel. Is everyone in port? Yeah, nice. Yeah, we have some issues with fuel as well. Um, we need to fix this. Maybe let's move to closed economy, yeah? Uh, 
Yeah, it's time. And um, yeah, the situation fixed for now, but. Twenty six per cent. Well, it's not good. And um, let's try it all out at once just for a bit. No, it's not working. Because of the lack of supplies, it seems. Yeah. Okay, let's drop this area. Still uh, getting some issues with uh, fuel. Yeah. Um, but uh, I think uh, we have still enough time to execute the research required to increase our production. Um, yeah. So I'm not sure what, yeah, we're still having issues here. Let's maybe add some more aircraft. Right, one could think, one would think that uh, Poland as uh, an industrial country should have more 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 air, airport air 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 base capacity but but it's not okay let's try at least to have these at least but these I just can't put them in okay Maybe upgrade, or oh, no, maybe not. Maybe let's not do that. Level here as well. Oh, this guy. I'm a yielding defender. Oh, yeah, I'm a yielding defender, sounds good. And we have a doctrine available, nice. Yeah, air superiority, yeah, this should help. Maybe this will help, huh? Fighters lost. Oh my god, we are losing fighters. Well, yeah, we are losing fighters. And, um, come on, stop.
what do you mean standing by? Ah, they don't have range. Don't have the range. All right. All right. Let's keep them there. Okay, we're done with excavation two. <laughs> so let's go on with fuel gun. We need fighters, right? And we need artillery. Okay, what can we do to manage the supplies? Maybe Zhukov needs to be removed from here. Yeah. Probably. Yeah. 20-32%. It's not good. remove Zhukov from here, it just not, doesn't do any good. But where will we, will we remove Zhukov? So it, it looks like we have a lot of supplies here. Alright, let's delete his orders. Let's try to move him here, maybe like this. You might lose some tiles here, but I guess it's not a big, big of problem. We should be as soon as Zhukov is gone, the supply situation should be become better, and we should be able to. Oh, will Germany attack us? No, I mean Japan. Let's check what's going on here in the east. Oh, they have a lot of problems on their hands with others. I don't think they will attack. We won't even bother. Okay, and here we have some nasty advancements by, by uh, German troops. Let's analyze. So we have enough, quite enough of defense. I don't understand why it's red. It seems that everything is fine. Maybe some of the divisions will retreat, but overall. Okay, did we lose some tiles here? Yeah, we did, I think. So are we better now in terms of supply? Yeah, 41%. It's slightly better, I believe. All right, Mr. Kuznetsov, we will find you some and um, should maybe extend our coverage a bit here. Okay, it seems that they managed to do some 
successful counterattack here. And Drupov is still in transit. Yeah, he has 60% supply now. Not bad. So, mods with uh, manpower. Okay, it seems that they switched to. They've switched to the. To what? To service by requirement or something like that, right? To extensive conscription. And now the manpower is growing. Okay. So what's up with Zhukov? Okay, it looks like we can attack right away because planning bonus is in, in place. Let's try to do that. And we need to... Okay, we have better winter attrition. Turn penalty, nice, nice stuff. And... Um, desperate measures. Penal battalions. It's well, it's not that interesting. <laughs> yeah, this one is good, but we can't. We need that the whole year to pass. Well, we can maybe mm -hmm. I'm afraid to, to get these horrible drawbacks because it just might everything is uh, hanging by the thread and we just might uh, start to lose um, another thing we can do is we can research another um, research slot this path and just for Zhukov let's try to advance actually let's try to have an allowed assault again now everything is red Zhukov. Yeah, we are not doing well, it seems. Another way to Increase our fighting strength would be to 
maybe research logistics logistics company and then add logistics uh, companies to everything and see if it will help with the supplies up yeah they they have quite a lot of divisions and the tide is slowly turning we were able to do some initial to manage some initial success but now Not that great. Okay, let's stop everything. Yeah. Treatment speed. Yeah, that's that's one is good. Well, let's check who German Rick. Reich is fighting with. So, uh, it basically, we are fine. We have the United States on our side, and we just need to maybe maybe struggle a little more to hold the, hold the line, and it should be better. Oh, actually, I understand what's going on. We have rudders here, but here we don't. Yeah. And it immediately had a lot of effect on our fighting capabilities and on our air superiority. Yeah. By the way, what's with the fighters? So more or less good. We are keeping up the production with losses. So, so yeah. So it seems that we can't uh, overthrow Germany by several big offenses, offensives. We need to take a slow approach, right? It's interesting. Okay. So we have uh, infantry bonus. Nice. Let's do that. And maybe we have to wait till till desperate measures focus or how they call trade will be removed. And then we have some interesting uh, focus focuses to uh, to discover and this should help. Meanwhile, let's move to defensive war and see what can we do in regards of um, Oh my god, it's so bad. We only have ten, 10 factories. Why is that? So we need 54 consumer factories. Yeah. yeah, we have quite a lot of military factories. And why is that? Actually, we can decrease supply consumption. Let's do that. And uh, one other thing to do will be to we need to somehow boost our uh, construction capabilities because it's only ten civil factors, not enough at all. 
I, I, I swear we had a lot more civil factors. Oh, maybe it's because, maybe it's because we stopped trading, right? We have nothing to do. Oh, actually, I forgot to. Okay, nice. All right. So. So now we should fire better. Yeah. And um, eighteen factories is, I think, better. Another thing to do would be to build some civilian factories or maybe do something else to. We can maybe move to total mobilization, yeah. Yeah, let's do that. You should do that. It's a pity I didn't do it earlier. Alright. So far. We're holding the line, yeah. Come on, guys, hold. Yeah, we're more or less holding the line. Oh, actually, here we are not holding the line. So, let's see what we can do. Maybe let's move these guys. These guys under Alexander Vasilevsky. First of all, let's move. his artillery to someone else to oh, this guy maybe oh actually it's not with him anyway alright no worries and let's move these guys to the as a second line of defense to this behind the river like this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So they will, they will hold the Romanian Romanians. Oh, come on. Should be fine. Yeah, something like that. So we will entrench and we will basically hold the line here. There. Okay, what's up with the supply? 67%, more or less fine. But Zhukov is not happy. Okay, let's move Zhukov to maybe this nice bulge. this and try to have this nice offensive possible supply situation here should be better okay let's try to do that and uh, probably need to train some more armies actually what kind of armies do we need I'm thinking maybe we need just the uh, usual defensive stuff or maybe yeah artillery is down so we need just some defensive armies maybe actually uh, let's just remove some of the artillery this 
and um, and let's train the so basically they became the same right and this and this yeah it's just this one has signal yeah they have they are now the identical that uh, it's relevant. So these guys, they are very like these are super, super defensive, and this has have some attack capability. Uh, so maybe we'll just train these guys. What's up with infantry equipment? Yeah, we we can maybe train one army of them. Um, uh, let's do that. It seems that we have enough infantry equipment. Yeah, just barely. Okay, so infantry equipment. situation with fuel now. It's just I had to close my economy to to alleviate fuel issues. Uh, later I maybe will move to limited exports again as uh, my uh, fuel efficiency, fuel gain efficiency, fuel refining will be better and yeah, I will be able to Meanwhile, we, we should move to, to total mobilization. No. Um, this will actually decrease our manpower, but we can switch to service by requirement. Should we first maybe switch to service by requirement? No. Well, this will create some nasty drawbacks. But work on yeah, minus three percent. should do that anyway. I should have just enough manpower to get by to switch to service by requirement. I, I'm also thinking maybe let's add some hospitals to both defensive divisions. enough support equipment we can afford that so Zhukov how it goes let's try to okay here we have better supply 75% and now we can we can get rid of this bulge yeah.
Okay, national specialist. Right. Nice. Consumer good factor is minus two percent. Nice. Oh, we can also add some civilian factors. It's very nice. Zhukov is doing fine. I bet you didn't see that coming, right? And uh, here we have so I just can't uh, spend my industrial capacity on. All right, now what? What happen, what's happening? What's happening is that yeah, we've got some supplies because the port was upgraded. Nice, and we can also I don't know if it, it will affect anything, but the infrastructure in Moscow will be maximum at a maximum level, which is nice as well. And then we will proceed with to build uh, synthetic refineries to alleviate fuel situation. Not fuel, but rubber, rubber situation, yeah. And what next? And we will also execute refining research. All right, so it seems that Zhukov offensive is now greened into a halt. We might uh, also take this tile, but maybe not much more than that. Yeah, trying to recapture the tiles. Across the river it's quite difficult to advance. Yeah. Okay, it looks like Zhukov needs to, to cut. Or does it? Well, it seems that we won't be able to advance much further. All right. So I'm always capturing some operatives, but. Seems that nothing helps. Okay, air drag train. So we can. Sure, we need air superiority. Alright, now we have some issues with this area. Let's switch some fighters back here. Recruitment is more or less fine, but I can't can't switch to upgraded ones because it will drastically reduce the equipment production. So what shall we do? It seems that this basic infantry equipment is not needed very much because. We only have what one division, so maybe let's switch basic infantry equipment 
to the most advanced one, like this. And this uh, infantry equipment will then go to the best troops. Garrison. Let's allow them to use these, but not the best. And regarding everything else, the best to only be reserved for for Zhukov. No. Yeah. Oh, these guys can use it as well. I'm fine with that. capture this tile but not much else. Oh actually we are having some issues, some progress here as well. How can I make them talk? There is no such op Runners here, we have it. We have it here. Okay, it looks like we can capture this tile as well. Uh, for fifty-one percent. Come on, yeah, we're capturing it. Okay, I guess Zhukov has it had it enough. Let's maybe edit this line. You can now have it here. Like this. Yeah. And as for Zhukov, let's see what else can he do. What I'm thinking is maybe let's change a bit Zhukov's template. Let's add some anti tank. Yeah. 74 with meaning. Anti air. Let's add some anti tank. Like this. Yeah, we have enough of that. And the com combat width will be 38, maybe it's too big. A bit. So let's remove some infantry. Yeah, like this. So we can now have some, an some anti tank ability. Because they have quite a lot of tanks already, several divisions. So the next goal for Zhukov would be to try to advance here, maybe. Let's try that. Like this. Do we have enough supply? Uh, yeah, seems that we have some, somewhat enough supply. Mm-hmm. 
So we can switch to total mobilization. Let's see what will happen with our manpower. Um, it's not clear. It's not clear what will happen with the manpower. <laughs> Pretty strange. Actually, in here we don't need it that much. Or maybe we can add them to defensive. Let's try to do that. So, <laughs> so what I was thinking about, ah, about the manpower. So we have only what two percent, maybe two point something. We definitely need to move to service by requirement. Yeah. And but, but uh, the construction, yeah, construction is not great. We don't need uh, military factories anymore because we we have them more than enough. And uh, I guess we will have to build uh, supply infrastructure. Upgrade the railways here, here. Um, what? Here, of course. And here. And here. What? Is it what maximum at maximum capacity or? And what about here? Oh, we have an incursion here. Oh my god. Kajukov. You are needed. Alright, let's try to advance here and then move him to Romania. We need to fix this. And by the way, maybe we can we can fuck them up using These divisions, yeah, we can maybe. Yeah, let's try to maybe get get them, drive them a bit, a bit back. Yeah. And Zhukov, how are you doing? No, Zhukov is not doing well. And let's see what we can upgrade here. Yeah, let's upgrade this base as well. And maybe this one, for good measure. But I think it's enough already. Okay, so... So I guess refineries can wait, maybe. Because we are not planning on expanding our rubber dependent production anytime soon. Let's build just one of each and uh, let's maybe 
get ourselves ourselves busy with uh, railroad protection. <laughs> yeah. Actually, this refinery can also wait. and then we will go on with the uh, railway upgrades and by the way do we have enough trains here we do all right so Zhukov it's not that good right yeah it's not that good at all Right, let's stop Zhukov and let's move him to Romanian front. Yeah, we have like more or less fine. Should we? No, we don't actually. So bad, we have quite a lot of river crossing. What kind of divisions do we have? Some Romania bastards. Okay, some more civil factors. Nice. <sighs> All right, what we can do? Yeah, we have some supply here. Not much, but still. can maybe remove mountain troops to some third line of defense yeah let's do that so we need them somewhere here like this okay. and instead we will put Zhukov here Shortly, we will try Romanian offensive. Come on, guys, stop, stop. It's enough. Okay, let's wait for Nuzhukov's organizations organization to to grow, grow back.
there is a storm going on here 45% not, not good Trade here, and let's put my Bajikov to this army. To our Shilov's army, yeah. and Zhukov, he's at six. He spawns a leader, but so how how else can we? Help our oh, guy Zhukov. So, who are these guys? Konev. Konev, Konev. Who is this guy? Konev, Konev. Yeah, he's here. Sixty-three percent. Alright, let's try Zhukov and Konev offensive together. Maybe only Zhukov for now. Yeah, I guess that's enough. Let's check Zhukov organizations. Organization. And as soon as it drops, let's advance Konev as well. Okay, seems that we are struggling but making some progress, at least in one. Yeah. At least in one tile. By the way, what's up with the planes? Okay, there. More needed here, I guess. And we also need uh, close air support. Let's move them here. Actually, yeah, here. And these guys will be moved here. And here, yeah, like this. Okay. Come on, Zhukov. So we are pressing them. We press them over the river, over the river, and yeah, it's, it's looking good. It seems. Yeah. Let's check what's going on on the other parts. So front. Have quite a lot of railways to, to build here. Yeah. Excavation three. Nice. So So we need concentrated industry for for some reason it was researched. Well that's bad. Okay, air doctrine. Naval mission efficiency. Um, let's maybe not research it now. Uh, let's maybe So the next uh, plane will be only at 44. So we can maybe upgrade this current guy. Current, current.
current point, current fighter, and uh, we can maybe prove ability. Yeah, because. happy with uh, higher support well we are we're doing fine why it matters Zhukov offensive yeah come on Zhukov and Konev actually what if we we should maybe uh, light up So we have quite to you should maybe reduce the width so the organization will be just above thirty three. Yeah. And uh, have kind of Rearrange these divisions as well, like this. So, Mr. Konev, are we happy? No. This will uh, reduce supply and uh, combat, and maybe will increase attack. Attack value. Yeah. Does it would help? No, I don't think it helps a lot. Come on, attack with everything. to regain some organization. Actually why Konev has Group a bit and then attack again. Okay, we're done with steel industrial blueprints. some bonuses in industry now do can I can I check it? Wow three hundred percent nice yeah that's good okay and what we can do now is we can prepare collaboration government maybe and for this Infantry civilian administration again. All right. So 
not so perfect construction. Yeah, when building the railways, it's all good. Come on, Zhukov, get in position. And Konev is doing some stupid shit. So we can maybe edit also this line. Like this. Conef is maybe defining a bit too large area. But it's fine. Zhukov, are you in position? Well, this ACES uh, messages are really annoying. Yeah, Zhukov is in position now. 15%, what the hell, man? No, we can't, we can't advance at 50%, 15%, of course. Maybe this whole... Uh, uh, offensive was a mistake. Let's actually maybe remove Zhuk from here because everything will just die. <laughs> here, yeah. So the only uh, curse of action for us is to wait for the railroads to be done. And meanwhile, let's remove Zhukov to maybe here. Yeah. Somewhere here, maybe. Train them, train him a bit to regular level at least. Okay, and now we can get the research slot. That needs to be done. Sure. Okay, come on, get out from here. It seems that we will lose our advancement, but that's fine. Of course, otherwise Zhukov will just. It's a supply nightmare. Okay, should we maybe move back some of our planes? Things like this. Yeah. Alright. How are we doing on fighters? Not, not good. Not good. Close air support suffer, suffering as well. But with uh, upgrading, with concentrated industry upgrade, it seems that we might do better. Right, Zhukov, get back from this supply hill and train a bit. the situation with supplies is probably not that bad, right? Alright. So maybe we can try to perform general offensive. Uh, 
first let's train Zhukov. Another thing we can do is we can maybe remove ref uh, um, artillery from these divisions and merge them back, merge them all. Actually, oh, we can add hospital here and merge them all together. Yeah. Or we can yeah, let's do that. <coughs> so let's uh, remove. Let's add hospital here. Yeah. Like this. And then let's make all the pounds into these. this defensive guys mm -hmm. yeah. okay they advancing but Shouldn't be a problem. Um, you probably need to train them to regulars, all of them, before advancing, before fighting. Yeah, they are capturing back everything. switch to service by requirement maybe we could have switched a bit a little but it's okay Panzer Division is trying to do something here, but no luck. Uh, 
That's my babe. Mr. Konev is holding the land more or less. Here we have some incursions. Yeah, they are trying to break us here. What's the rules? Yeah, they, um, they, uh, they will be running out of manpower at this rate quite soon because what they have lost an additional 2 million for the last half a year and they have what a million available manpower. So in the war of attrition we are winning, it seems. They are wasting them in power and these not so useful attacks. So let's wait for some of them at least become regular as well. For this one. It's also helping very much that it's a defensive war. Um, we can also upgrade our closer support, maybe, or maybe let's upgrade fighters again. Something like this, maybe. Yeah. Or maybe engine to the max. Fighters will probably be better. So we can maybe use Drukov here because we have enough supply here. supply, we are doing fine. How is it going with the railway construction actually? Well, still a lot of... seems that the situation, supply situation is already improving nice. So, also these two are now the same, right? right? So we can organize everything to stars. We have only stars here. Let's 
make everything stars. And here we only have. Yeah. And we can retire these guys. So we only now have three types of divisions. Assault division, uh, like like basic assault division, uh, Zhukov's assault division, and Konev with a bit better combat width and with 300 attack. And the breakthrough should also be a bit more, yeah. But with the organization lower. I don't know if this is a good division at all. They have huge soft attack, but yeah, I guess it's like it's a bit more expensive, but I guess yeah. Fair better in attack. Oh, we can upgrade our doctrine. Yeah, this is. What do you mean, recruitable population 5%? Let's wait for the plants to to grow. What's up with the support? It's all good, you know. Kajukov, come on. I just I'm just curious to see how it he will fare. So we are able to advance it seems. Help Zhukov with overall offensive. But for 
some reason Zhukov is suffering from supply issues right away, but I don't understand. It was quite nice. Alright, so let's research National Academy of Sciences and we also can now research construction. have the required network strength. Well, let's build into a network then. some success and getting him what does it mean German German East Indies what does it even mean So it looks like Zhukov achieved the objective, which was nice. Who is Boris Shapushnikov? Can we upgrade the multi stars? getting some bonuses against us. Maybe we should Zhukov. Let's check the supply situation. Um, Fifty-five percent. Not great, not terrible, as they say.
So maybe try. Let's try to have li another limited offensive for these mountains. Like this, maybe. France. Actually, let's check what's up with German fleet. What do we have? <laughs> they have three battleships, and we have what? Two battleships. Submarines. Maybe we can Maybe what do you mean detached? Um, yeah, let's put them on patrol. Жуков. Let's wait for the divisions to arrive. Done with logistics. Let's upgrade it. Probably need to add them to everything because supply is a limiting factor in our battles. So, how do we do, Zhukov? Not so good, huh? Okay, I guess it's time for us to wrap this up. Um, this offensive was not really a success. Um, we probably need to wait a bit. Let's not sp spend our equipment in uh, these futile attacks. Okay. 
So we have another another army to put somewhere. Where to actually? I don't know. Let's put it in reserve somewhere, and we will use it as we will see fit. Maybe let's put it here. Something like that. So, as for Zhukov, let's move them, let's move him back somewhere here, maybe. Efficiency, strategic bombing, interception detection. Well, and again, and again. Now build the academies of science. Nice. No time for peace. We weren't able to finish everything here. Put it on the back burner for now. Meanwhile, maybe let's organize our military. So I guess uh, we need to finish this part. Thanks everyone. Have a nice day. Um, our next part, in our next part, we will continue uh, this campaign against Germany. I hope that. Someone will help us. Maybe United States. Um, oh, that's 
is uh, manageable yet as of, yet, as of now. And uh, war is going in our favor. Let's check what's up with the manpower. Yeah, it's diminishing. Nice. So basically, this war will, will be won by attrition. Um, the industry is growing, but As soon as we uh, as soon as we will alleviate our supply situation, uh, we should probably be we will probably be able to advance without much issue. stars often and we will continue advance to advance yeah. something like that also we should maybe train another army yeah should be so the star army Thanks everyone, have a nice day.